Hi everybody, I'm Lisa. Behind the camera is Build Together We Are Belize. So welcome to our channel. Today we have a wonderful memory we'd like to share with you from one year ago today. We were at Disneyland with our friend Stephanie and we headed into the Golden Horseshoe Saloon for some ice cream. This day though in particular was very amazing because I was picked from the audience to play the very important role of Slewfoot Sue in the Frontierland stage production. Roll the clip! Hi right, folks, welcome to Golden Horseshoe Saloon. We're so glad to have you all here with us. Let's get the fun started with an old favorite. I want to y'all clap along with me. Here we go. Oh, I'm going to come back on the band with a man you want by me. I'm going to be together on my true love for the sea. It rained all night today, I went the weather, it was dry. It got so hot, I froze up there, Susanna, don't you cry. Everybody, oh, Susanna, don't you cry for me. Some of the gold horseshoe, Miss Rose, and the Honorable Mayor of Frontier Land, Sam McGillicuddy! You play nice, y'all. 
you got a bus made this precious cars the frontiers golden queen yeah i'm talking about that special lady a lady i like to call my home frontier land this lady's got a golden horseshoe and a shooting gallery this gal's got a silver river Far as the eye can see, she was built by man and critter, living in harmony. That's why I love Frontierland, she's a federal town for me. Frontierland! She's so, so peaceful. Frontierland! Oh, so tranquil. Frontierland! It's made of wood! <laughs> and that's what makes Frontierland a little town. And now we turn to all of you fine folks. Yeah, even that guy. Go ahead and sing along with us in the chorus. Oh, but Rose, they're going to sing, they should do the choreography. Yeah! And it's really simple, everybody. It goes like this. Front, tier, land. Now, don't worry. As long as we're all doing it together, no one's going to look, look silly, all right? So here we go. Front, tier, cut. I was completely wrong about that. <laughs> we're going to do it anyways. In the spirit of the pageant. A five, six, seven, eight. Frontier land. It's oh so peaceful. Frontier land. Oh, that oh so tranquil. Frontier land. It's made of wood. And that's what makes frontier land the little town that could. And that's what makes frontier land the little town that could. It's made of wood. Yeah. The shout again, hey, buddy. We well, certainly do. You guys were awesome. Hey, man, now would be a good time for me to do the speech I was talking about. So now, actually, it's a good time for you to grab the script that I wrote for you. And we're going to begin on page one, everyone. Or on page one? No confusion now, because it's, a, it's, a, it's page one. <laughs> Front two. It began. It's a vast wilderness. With a beauty that only nature can deliver. From its big thunder mesa. To its long, scurvy river. That's curvy. It's a curvy river. <laughs> curvy river. It's that same long, curvy river that brought forth a legend to these parts. But he was a great man. A man who knew no fear. Who knew no fear? Or his cue for that matter. Oh, where could he be? Where could who be? Dr. Filler! The dentist? Yeah, he's playing the part. Well, I doubt the dentist is a man that knew no fear. Well, where is he? He's in jail. What? Yeah, I know he's supposed to be here, but I had to arrest him this morning. He was fighting out in the street, and that's why I thought I should do a speech. You know what, Clint? Give your sweet little speech. Oh, no, no, Rose, you said no speech of mine. <laughs> no, I was talking to you, Mr. the politician. Hey, Rose, look, look, look. I'll handle this, all right? Handle it. We're gonna go with it. You see, it was the same long, curvy river that, that brought forth a legend to these parts. And he was a great man. He's a man who knew no fear. He's a man sitting right here. Come on, have a line to turn up. Come on, over. Give the guy a Hold on to that. Or a pork right there. Put it up top like a hat. Hey, doesn't that look good, y'all? There you go. Oh, yeah. Hey, it looks great. All right, Evan. Now, don't you mess this up. <laughs> All right. Now, along the rivers of America, Davy did a row. Go and row your little boat. Don't make row me do all the work, Edwin. There, there we go. There you go. Then he's shouting out. Why is worthy a lame-o? Oh, it's uh, a all lame-o. And it's just Alamo. Oh, okay, okay. He shouted out, remember the Alamo. So let's give that a shot. Ready, and? <laughs> Close to it. Yes, he does. It's really nice. <laughs> You shout out, remember the Alamo, all right? So, ready? Here we go. Ready, and? Yeah! 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 Yeah!
put down the sign. I'm trying to order some applesauce. Man, it doesn't... I get hungry in a show. Davey wanted to build a town on this new land, so he asked our next legend to lend a hand. I said to lend a hand. Who's supposed to lend a hand? Nelson, the town manicurist. Oh, of course he is. He's supposed to be here, except I had to arrest him this morning. It was him that was fighting with Dr. Filler. Okay, stop, Clem. Just stop. The dentist and the town manicures were fighting? Yep, they was going at it tooth and nail. Can you my these now? Sure. Oh, no, I don't want you talking no more, actually. Oh, I do. I'm taking care of this one, too. You see, to build this town, much work needed to be done. So, Jamie, he asked our next legend. I see you hiding back there. I need your help, Paul Bunyan. Come on up. Give this guy a big old round of applause as he makes his way on up to the stage. And let's find out who this is. What's your name? Rainier. Ruth, are you here? Rainier. Rainier. Sorry, Rainier. If you say howdy, Rainier. Howdy, He's going to play the part of Paul Bunyan. Hey, Paul. Lit, but <laughs> <laughs> Rutherford's gonna play the part of Paul Biden with his big, okay, big ish blue box screen. Had some cutbacks, some galaxy thing, I don't know, okay. <laughs> right, here, here we go, all right. Davey, Paul, and Dave, they worked day and night. Paul would chop! Chop a tree, Paul. Chop that tree. Chop that tree. Wow! <laughs> he would actually chop with his face, his actual. <laughs> That's hardcore. <laughs> And, uh, Davy was hammered. Clem? Ha! <laughs> uh, Davy would hammer. And they would heave. Yeah! Rose! Yeah! Hooray! Yeah. Oh, heave! And ho, yeah. and ho. They worked through day and night, through rain and snow. Paul would chop wood from July to December. And as each tree fell, he would yell out. What? No, Clem, he would yell out. Hey, but that was amazing. That was amazingly wrong, actually. <laughs> it's interesting. You're a lumberjack, right? You shout out Timber, all right? So let's give that a practice. Here we go, ready? And... Timber! Yeah. Yeah. Frontierland was built and all made of wood. I told you. Yeah. Yeah. And the settlers moved in just as fast as they could. Thank you, Frontierland, we're done! No, 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 no. Well, there's more. Yeah. As long as he quickly, our little town grew. I said, a little town grew. You could huff and puff and say whatever you want, but ain't no one coming. Who are we waiting for now? That's me, the Pony Express writer. Yeah, well, she's supposed to be here, setting my. You arrested her, her this morning. morning. How did you know that? I, I had to. She jumped in the fight with Dr. Filler. I got this one. The Pony Express grew, and the dentist got in a fight. A tooth in mail. No, hoof and mouth. <laughs> Can I hear my speech now? Yes. No. No. Yes. Huh? Well, look, let me take care of this one too, all right? As I say, quickly, our little town grew, and amongst the famous residents was a legendary slew of shoes. You heard me, Robert? Right what is your name? Lisa. Lisa, get on stage. Everybody say, Howdy, Lisa. Howdy, Lisa. She's playing the part of Slew Foot Sue. Slew it, slew it, slew it, slew Also from the audience. Alright, so here is a hat and a hairdo. <laughs> Alright, Lisa, here we go. Now, slew it, she rode into town. Go ahead and ride your horse. Okay, there you go, yeah! Woo! Sound effects, that's good. Ah, uh, she rode it. She rode it. Yes, you are. Uh, that's okay. Yeah, come on. Clear. Clear! Oh. Sorry, I was enjoying the ride. Okay. <laughs> now she rode the town, all right? The plan is to settle down. And as she rode, she, she twirled her lasso. There you go, yeah. And she would holler out. Geronimo. No cramp. She would holler out. Timber. Oh, she would holler out. Remember the Alamo. Yes, she goes, you bet. Yes, she are. <laughs> no, 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 it's she, all right, Lisa, all right? She would holler out. Yippee-yay-yay, -yay, yippee yay yo So here you go, ready, and? Can-can show! A five, six, seven, eight! Oh yeah! 
This here, yeah. this is the finest entertainment that Disney has to offer. Yeah. The legends are doing a good job. Yes, they are. Now there's one more legend, a hero we all know. A person who did so much to help Frontierland grow. A great man and a friend to everybody. On election day, vote for... That's right, I'm your mayor and I plan to keep it that way, Maybe everybody. You this is not what we came out here to do at all. Now, give me just a second, let me make some sense out of this. Alright, folks, look, Frontierland is a lot more than just a town. It's a lot more than just my home. Frontierland is a feeling. And it's a feeling that you get whether you're new to town or whether you lived here your whole life. It's the same feeling when you sit with your family at supper. Or when you see a loved one heading up the trail toward you. Well, it makes you want to come together and work hard. To build a community where there truly are no strangers. So that way, no matter where you're from, Remember the animal. no matter what you do, Timber. you know when you come to Frontierland, you'll be greeted with a very warm yeah. Yeah. And that is how you know Frontierland ain't just my home, it's all of our homes. Come on, y'all. Right. Man, that was lovely. That was truly heartfelt. And you know what? There's not a lick of politicking in it. Let's hear from all the legends that help us out here today. Lisa and Slew Clifford News, Evan and Danny Crockett, Rear Heads, Paul Bunyan, oh, Big Club Number, a five, six, seven, eight. Frontierland, it's most so peaceful. of August and September in 2019, we made our way into the Golden Horseshoe to watch the Laughing Stock Company put on their production as often as possible because we had been informed that as of September 14th, 2019, the Laughing Stock would not be performing any longer. I hope you enjoyed our video. Don't forget to smash the thumbs up button and don't forget to subscribe. Bye.